hello everybody and welcome to this episode of G-Bear's Off-Grid Ways. That's right, they're my ways. A homestead in the desert. And here we are on September something. Uh, can't remember the exact day, but I'll look it on the calendar and put it in the title, make sure you know. So you can look it back up if you have to down the line. Or when you're sharing it with somebody, you can say, hey, check out G-Bear's such and such a day video. Anyway, look at that stack of pallets. Yep. I just got out of the shower a little while ago. That's why I'm shooting so late. Because I had to wash all the yellow paint off my arms. And the uh, words heister off uh, the, my back and front. And... Uh, also had got really tired. I mean, uh, my throat's a little bit raw, so excuse me, because I had to keep saying beep, beep, beep every time I backed up. Uh, anyway, I unloaded that whole stack off of the trailer all at once without a forklift, only a bear. People say, how come you don't show yourself on camera? Well. Uh, you you humans are not ready to see what I look like. Uh, for my planet, we're a little bit different. <laughs> All right, everybody, enough of that, right? Anyway, I did get them off. Got them right where I wanted them here. They're not in the way of opening up the containers or anything like that. And uh, they're not blocking the driveway. Yeah, so, just fine. And... Uh, I uh, went down and cleaned out all of the chicken coop and the chicken cages. I've been busy today. I'm kind of tired. I need to take a break. I need to sit down and relax. But before I do, a beautiful sunset. Just sun just went down a little while ago. Yeah, those idiot lights up there. You know what that is. But uh, yeah, there's a planet up there. Not sure which one that is. Might be Saturn or something like that. And there's another one over there. Why did that blur out on me all of a sudden? That's weird. Oh, there it goes. Now, why did it do that? That's strange. Anyway, maybe that's not a planet, right? It's an alien spaceship coming to take me away. Ha ha to the funny farm where life is enjoyable every day they're coming to take me away oh god i remember that song that was the weirdest thing i ever remembered hearing anyway i'm hobbling over yeah i'm still hobbling if i spend too much time on my foot uh, it gets a little bit sore by the end of the day but uh last night i threw a couple of slices of onions in a old baggy sock pulled it on that foot went to bed and oh my god i slept like a baby i mean i really slept well got up this morning just feeling just peachy dandy all right let me get to the part i really wanted to get to today um i wanted to do this a little bit lighter but i needed the sun to set so you could see the light you see that light on right there on the table Okay, well, what is that? Well, that's a product that was sent to me by... Oh, let me sit down here. Yep, take some weight off. That's a product that was sent to me by um, an interested party. And uh, what is it? You remember Pow Buzz? They're the makers of that little electric screwdriver I gave away in uh, one of the prior videos quite a while back well this is another one of their products and they sent me an email and they've got a whole line of products out now and uh i'm i'm actually i was supposed to have um done a video on this thing a long time ago but what had happened was i got this thing and on it it says mosquito killer well guess what I don't have mosquitoes. I'm in the, a very hot, dry desert, and even hotter and drier this year than normal. 
and without moisture and heavy rains and stuff like that we don't have mosquitoes so i saw that and i said well what am i going to do with this thing and i was thinking maybe i could send it to somebody who has mosquitoes so they can test it out and so forth and so on and i read the book on it and all of that and everything on it says mosquito killer here and there and i'm sorry it's a little bit dark hard to see right now but i'll be showing this box again in the daylight because I'm actually testing this thing tonight. And what I'm doing here is this thing comes with these little bait things that you're supposed to put here in the top, in the top of this thing right there in that little opening. And then it also has these little round paper discs that have uh, glue on them, kind of like fly paper. And this bottom area right here is where all of the bugs are supposed to end up and just in case some bugs uh, mosquitoes got in um, and there's a fan on this thing that sucks them down if they get too close and just in case it, they don't get killed when they go through because it does have a zapper in it too they uh, end up um, in the bottom they could get back out when you shut the thing off so they had that little glue sticky thing down there. So if they do go in there, they land, they get stuck in there and they end up dying anyway. Okay. So I didn't put the little gluey thing in the bottom and I didn't put the bait in the top because I don't have mosquitoes. And actually, because it's been so hot and dry this year, I don't have a whole heck of a lot of bugs out here. I mean, I've seen some flies around, and I got my little fly swatter. That's been taking care of that. And, uh, I mean, you know, every now and then a little desert wasp, wasp or something like that. Um, a moth or two. Uh, mostly ants. Ants have been a, a little problem this year. Because the ants are underground. They don't care if it's hot and dry. And they get up and they go look for something, and they end up... Uh, getting into everything and anything and they end up biting me and things like that but i decided to give this thing a shot no bait no sticky trap just a light and a zapper and see if it works for anything other than mosquitoes so it's sitting here it's running the light is on and i'm going to let it sit out here all night because right now there's a breeze blowing. I've got my windproof mic on. But um, there's a breeze blowing. And I'm not being bothered by any bugs. And as you can see, there's no bugs flying around the light. But let's give it a shot anyway and see what happens with this thing. See if it does any good. And then I'll do tomorrow morning, I'll do a, a follow-up on this video. And we'll see how the Pow Buzz Mosquito Killer bug zapper whatever whatever works and then i'll give you my opinion on the product how's that sound everybody all right that's about all i have i want to thank you for joining me and uh go ahead i still have some of that yellow on my arms anyway <laughs> thanks for joining me don't forget the thumbs up down there don't forget to subscribe and share this is g bear thanking you and signing off